Your physician has prescribed a biocompression sequential circulator for your treatment. All of our pumps are designed for home or hospital use. This video will guide you through the setup of the eight chamber sequential circulator SC4008DL from start to finish. Always reference the instruction manual for a complete understanding of operations and precautions for your pump and garment. Let's get started. First, Unpack your biocompression pump and take out all of the components. The carton and end caps should be saved for future transporting, shipping, or reuse. Make sure you have the following items in the box. A sequential circulator pump. Blocker bars for use during single garment therapy. A power cord. An instruction guide. Your garments may have been shipped separately and are necessary for operation and treatment. Choose a location to set up your pump. Place the pump on a flat, sturdy surface in close proximity to a reclining chair, bed, or sofa where you will be comfortable during treatment. Attach the power cord to the back of the pump and then plug it into an outlet. This sequential circulator has touchscreen LCD display, garment connector bar ports, auxiliary connector bar ports shown with blocker bars, Leave the blocker bar in place to block airflow if you are treating only one limb. If you are treating two limbs, you won't need the blocker bar, but you should store it safely for future use. Now it's time to attach the garments. The Quick Connect system makes it easy to connect tubes from your garments to the pump. Line up the chamber numbers 1 through 4 on the latch connector with the corresponding numbers on the pump. With the numbers facing up, squeeze the clip and insert into the port. It's that easy. Then line up the second latch connector five through eight and attach the same way. If you are using a second garment, attach the second latch connectors in the same way. Wear light, loose-fitting clothing under the compression sleeves. This is both hygienic and will avoid irritation. Clothing should be free of zippers, buttons, or other items that could rub or chafe the skin or damage the sleeves. Avoid wearing jeans or constricting clothing. To don leg garments, carefully unzip it. Place your heel at the bottom and back and use the pull-up straps to guide the sleeve onto your leg. Then pull the zipper up to secure the garment. To don arm garments, slide your arm through the internal cavity of the sleeve. Make sure that your fingers are comfortably inside the sleeve. Your hand should be flat. Treatment time has been determined by your physician. And remember, if your doctor has prescribed bilateral treatment, you can do that simultaneously. To change pump settings or use focus therapy, touch the screen to wake. When the home screen lights up, press and hold the lower right corner of the touch screen for three seconds until you see the main setup screen. The first screen that appears is the pressure setting screen. Press up or down to adjust the pressure, beginning with chamber one and press chamber to move to the next chamber. Repeat the previous steps to set each chamber. Please note, you cannot set the pressure in the next chamber higher than the previous chamber. When all the chambers have been set, press next. You are now on the cycle time screen. Press up or down to adjust the cycle time Press next when finished. You are now on the treatment time screen. Press up or down to adjust the treatment time. To set to continuous mode, press up once more after 120 shows on the display, then the word continuous will appear. Press next when finished. You are now on the focus therapy screen. Press up or down to select the chambers for focus therapy or off to turn this feature off. Press next when finished. You are now on the pre-therapy screen. You can choose either on or off for this therapy. You can now review the settings on the screen. Press done if everything is correct. Press setup if you still need to make changes. Once you hit done, setup complete will show on your screen. Then you will see all of your settings. Then the screen will show start in the bottom left corner. Your pump is now set to your new settings. 
Starting your treatment, sit in a comfortable reclined position with legs elevated and within reach of your pump. Touch the LCD screen to wake. After five seconds, your setting will appear on the screen. Press Start to begin treatment. To change the pressure setting on your pump while in use, press and hold the bottom right of the screen for three seconds. Please Wait will appear on your screen. The screen will then show your current pressure settings. You can adjust the pressure by pressing up or down. When finished, press Set. To pause during treatment, press Pause. Please Wait will appear on the screen while the pump returns to its resting position. The sleeve will then begin to deflate. Paused Press to Continue will appear on your screen. You may now remove your garment and take care of what you need to do. When ready to resume treatment, touch the LCD screen anywhere to unpause and continue treatment. The pump will continue to inflate. Once set, the pump will automatically inflate each chamber to the proper pressure. Sequential pumps with gradient pressure have proven to be the best devices for reducing the amount of excess fluid in a limb in a comfortable and efficient manner. Our pumps mimic the action of your own body by providing a pumping action from distal to proximal, allowing excess fluids to be reabsorbed by your body, thus providing reduced pain, improved lymphatic and vascular flow, wound healing, prevention of infection, effective prophylaxis for venous thrombosis, and reduced dynamic edema, all while improving your quality of life. At the end of a timed treatment, your pump will turn off. If using the pump in continuous mode, press Stop. Please Wait will appear on your screen while your pump returns to its resting position. When it has, the garment will start to deflate and the LCD screen will turn off. To expedite the deflation of your sleeve, simply bend your limb. Once the garment is loose enough, unzip and remove it. To view your treatment compliance meter, otherwise known as hours of use, touch screen to wake. The opening screen will be displayed. Then it will change to the setting screen briefly before the start screen is then displayed. While the start screen is displayed, press and hold the bottom center of the screen for five seconds. Your compliance hours will now be displayed. If you ever need to reset your pump back to the factory settings, while the compliance meter is showing, Press and hold the bottom right corner of your screen for three seconds. A message will appear, reset to factory defaults. Press yes to reset or no to turn pump off. Thank you for choosing BioCompression. We hope to improve your quality of life starting today. Should you have further questions, please contact your local provider.